29 in the morning, but I'm freaking out because when I, um, so I went to Ed Sheeran last night, as you guys have seen, and I Snapchatted, um, Melissa Trippy, Charles Trippy's sister, and told her that he played Hearts Don't Break around here, because when he first went on tour, he said that he wasn't really playing that song, but he played it for one show and absolutely loved playing it, so he started playing it more, and she had put up, like, a Snapchat or something saying that she loves that song, so I Snapchat her saying, hey, he just played it, and I thought of you, and she answered. <laughs> So, here's what happened. There we go, kind of. Oh my god, uh, I'm so jealous. It was an incredible concert. And I told her yes. And I feel like I'm talking to a celebrity, and I doubt she'll ever see this, but if you are, you just made my Saturday morning. <laughs> Thank you, Melissa. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do today yet. I woke up a little bit earlier than I anticipated, but I might do some exploring. Yeah, I'll figure it out and obviously take you guys along. It's been real, room 117. Has Thanks for, uh, thank you for letting me sleep in you. <laughs> uh, you're a great bed and room. So yeah, I'm leaving the motel right now. Just dropped off my key, which I was kind of sad about because I wanted to keep it as a souvenir because I'm weird like that. <laughs> Again, I don't really need a souvenir because now I have this as a souvenir. I can remember the fun times I had. So yeah, that's going to do it from Connecticut. Um, still trying to figure out what I'm going to do today. I'll, all I know is that I need coffee, so that's going to be the first thing on my list. Gotta go to the promised land, aka Starbucks. If I think of anything else, I'll let you guys know. <clears throat> guys, there's a pirate ship. That's as far as my camera zooms though, I'm sorry. I don't know where I am, but I am somewhere in Connecticut on a scenic overlook thing. Sorry, my zoom's awful too. And yeah, isn't it pretty? Alright, so I made the decision to visit a place in Rhode Island that I will disclose later, but I just went from like the coast of Connecticut. Oh, now I'm in Pocatuck, Connecticut. Um, no, but I went to like a nice, like, like a sea town, and now all of a sudden I'm surrounded by farms. Of course, as soon as I start saying that, it's like civilization again. But I just drove by, I don't even know how many farms, but this town, or this state is gorgeous. If you ever get the chance to go to Connecticut, go, because it's very pretty and there's a lot to do here. It's very, I don't even know what word I'm looking for. I don't know which way I'm going. This is bad. So I'm gonna admit that I'm a super creep and I just drove by Taylor Swift's house in Rhode Island twice. She, and I think she's there because there's a shit ton of security. All right, so the surprise little trip I was taking was to see Taylor Swift's house in Rhode Island, which I did twice. I just drove by, but there's like a decent amount of security around there. So maybe she's there. So I just drove by Taylor Swift, I guess I could say. <laughs> I wanted to try and like find a parking spot so I could walk down to like the beach near her house, but parking was kind of expensive because she lives in an expensive part of Rhode Island, obviously. Yeah, I mean like look at some of the houses though. Like these houses are in sane. So if I was her, I would totally live here too. Like, this is unreal. Um, I don't know what else I'm gonna do for right now. Oh, there's a pretty view for you guys. I'm trying to find somewhere that I can, like, pull off and actually, like, vlog. Wow. I, uh, yeah. So, yeah. Just drove by Taylor Swift's house twice. So, I don't know if that makes me like a super crazy weird fan, but whatever. I will meet her one day. <laughs> Maybe when everyone kind of like forgets about her. Ooh, another cool house. So, yeah, uh, that's gonna do it from Westerly, Rhode Island. I was gonna say, if you guys ever wanna go there, I know how to get here now. <laughs> So I could bring you and we could look at her gate and all of her security because that's the thing you can't really see her house But it says no trespassing private property and there's a bunch of security guards around it So you can kind of tell it's her house. All right ladies and gents We have a new winner in the weirdest billboard competition Started off with oh, <laughs> there's another no exit sign started off with turn hump day into date night but we have a new winner um have you seen those commercials for like the buy drinking water and it's justin timberlake and christopher walken and it goes bye, bye, bye. like it has but like the lyrics of bye 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 in it well it was by that company and it's a like the billboard says sugar shouldn't be anyone's daddy i'm sorry what please don't ever like no that's not okay <laughs> like that sign is not okay who is approving 
These billboards, I need to know. So I don't know why the universe hates me, but it seems like, <laughs> I'm gonna say that a lot. That's what I should change the name of the vlogs to. The universe hates me. But I literally only get stuck in traffic when I have to pee. I'm still probably like a half hour away from my house. And I've been on the road since probably 9.30 and it's now almost noon. And this is just, this is awful. Like, <laughs> everywhere I go, I've been hitting traffic. Like, there was one highway where to get six miles, it was going to take 140 minutes, which, obviously, I'm not going to sit in 140 minutes of traffic. And then I tried to take, like, a different highway, and now I'm still in traffic. Like, the estimated ride home from where I was, so, like, when I went to go see Taylor Swift's house, the estimated ride home was, I think, like, an hour and seven minutes. And now, all of a sudden, it's turned into a three-hour drive. Like, all I know is I need to pee, I need to get home. I keep hitting every goddamn red light. This is... I can't do it guys. I can't. <laughs> You're just hoping I get home. And I also had to stop for gas. I had to stop. Oh god, my brakes are squeaking. Um, I had to stop for gas. So that was another fun, like, delay of my trip. So this vlog went from being really good to now me just bitching about traffic. Sorry guys. <laughs> but uh, Melissa Trippy Snapchat me back again, so that's fun. I don't know what she said yet, because I'm going to wait until I get home to open it. But yeah, I'm probably going to tell her about the vlog. Maybe she'll watch it. So if somehow most of Trippy's watching this, hi! Yeah, all right, bye. <laughs> all right, guys, I did a thing. I did it yesterday, but it's fine. I did a thing. Are you ready to see what that thing is? I got my nose pierced, and I'm very obsessed with it. Um, <laughs> If you're friends with me on Snapchat, you've already seen this. I did it last night with some friends, and I absolutely love how it is. Um, I thought I was gonna, like, I'm not good with needles. Like, when I got my tattoo, I threw up and almost passed out. And then, to get the piercing yesterday, I, every time I started getting, like, worked up, I knew what to do to calm myself down. So I would calm myself down and be like, all right, I'm fine. And then, like, I went on, like, sat on the table. Like, all my friends went first. So I sat on the table, the piercer, I'll tell you her information in a minute. <laughs> because I highly recommend her. She put the mark on my nose. She's like, do you want to see it? I'm like, no, I'm good. Just, I need to get this over with. <laughs> so she put it on, did everything she had to do. I laid on the bed. And then I was like, can you just do me a favor and not tell me what you're going to do? She's like, all right, I'm just going to tell you to breathe. I was like, okay. So she's like, all right, keep breathing. Okay, big exhale, or big deep breath. So I went, and then on the, on the exhale, <laughs> she pierced it. And I'm gonna, not going to lie, it hurt. It just feels like someone's just like pinching your nose. Like, so see how long my nails are? That's like someone was just pinching my nose with nails. It was sore for just like a couple minutes. And then I like, just since then, I keep forgetting that I even have it. <laughs> like if I like, ready, this is gonna hurt. So if I tear up, that's why. Like if I like, ow, 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 ow. <laughs> if I like wiggle my nostrils, then it hurts. And I also cleaned it for the first time this morning and it was very <laughs> funny because it's like saline, so like you do one up your nose and then you have to do the outside, but the up your nose one was hilarious. I should have vlogged it, but yeah. So her name, I have it on my in my phone. She gave me her card, that's not it. So her name is Angie at Visions, Tat uh, Visions Tattoo Piercing Art Gallery in Medway. If you want more of her information, please just contact me if you're in the Massachusetts area or the area close enough to go see her. <laughs> Hope I got a notification. Ig uh, ignore. That's the word I was for my appearance. I just woke up and started doing chores and stuff. I'm trying to think of what else. Yeah, I'm really happy with how it looks. Um, I can't wait to switch it out because I really want the hoop, but this will work for now. I like that it's like purple. And yeah, I'm really happy I did it. And I'm mostly just proud that I didn't get sick or pass out. It was a hell of a weekend. I'm glad that I brought the vlogging camera along so that I have footage for you guys or like content for you guys. Yeah, here's to more fun vlogs. This week will actually probably be fun too because I'm going to a couple shows this, this week. What's the date? It's either this week or next week. I can't remember. Not this week. I'm going to a couple shows next week. <laughs> I'm going to get my oil changed this week, so that could be fun for the vlog. And then, ooh, I'm getting my hair cut this week. More, to my, <laughs> more fun stuff is coming, guys. It's gonna be a summer to remember, vlogs to remember, and I am so excited. Shout out to Jarvis for bringing me to the concert this weekend. Shout out to Billy Grenham, if you're watching. He told me that he loves watching these, and I hope that he watches this one. Hi. And shout out to anyone else that watches. Thank you for watching. Thank you for taking the time to see how strange and funny my life is. 
I really appreciate it. And I usually don't say this in the videos, but I will today. If you like these videos, please click the like button. Uh, subscribe so that you know exactly when I post videos since I do it so infrequently. Comment. Talk to me. Um, you can look at the other videos if someone comments. I'm very good about responding. And yeah, follow me on social medias. I have them all underneath, I believe. I think that's it. I'm probably forgetting something, but whatever. So I'm gonna finish up some cleaning and then probably nap because I'm exhausted from this weekend. Alright, I will see you guys next time.